Last week, Adobe released a new update and a new program to Adobe Premiere. It's called Adobe Rush. And it's great for people who make content on the run. Today, we're going to have a look at loading intro. But there's something holding on in the way of being long gone. Welcome back to the channel, my name is Jerry, I'm from Wilshire Anywhere, I've come outside today because I want to talk to you about how to edit on the run and the new Adobe Rush program you can download on your phone and on the computer. Adobe Rush is the latest from Adobe and Adobe Premiere, it's a, a mobile app it's an iPad app and it's a desktop app that you can use to edit and record videos on the run. Now I'm a Final Cut Pro 10 user because my Mac is just too slow to run Adobe Premiere when it comes to rendering and exporting. It just takes forever. But Final Cut Pro and Apple need to be worried because Premiere are seriously becoming a major competition. And if Apple don't do something soon, they're going to be left behind. I installed Adobe Rush on my phone the other night and I gave it a bit of a go. I'll show you that video and then I'll tell you how I would incorporate it into my workflow if I were to use it. Let's have a look. So that's the latest from Adobe Rush. It was quite easy, my phone is a little bit slow at processing the um, files, but this would come in handy if I were to go to Melbourne or wherever I am recording all the footage, but could be by ripping out my computer to edit. Maybe I'll just have half an hour here or there and this would save time and then once I go home I could easily open it up on my computer and it will be there. My file will be there, my project and I can swap and change between my project on the computer and then if I'm out I can work on it on my phone. And what this also does is let multiple creators work on one project simultaneously. It's really a great update 
and Apple should seriously be worried. I hope they come out with um, a better version of Final Cut Pro. They released their new computers on Tuesday and they're beefy so there's no reason why they can't put out a nicer version of editing software. I know this is a really quick video but I just wanted to share my thoughts on the new software from Adobe. It's really great, no one paid me for this review. If you like it, give me a thumbs up. And if you like what I do and you do what I like, remember to subscribe to my channel. I'm up to 123 subscribers. I'm blown away. Thank you so much for your support. Now, I will see you in the next one.